brothers and sisters of celestial energy, brother wisdom, what's going on with you guys? The energy is heavy, 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 heavy. Right here in uh, Detroit, though, they they spray in the sky like real heavy, you know, and you gotta understand why they dis they they try to destroy the energy here in the city. You, and because you're talking about a city that is, you know, predominantly melanin. So we are, we, our, our people are already giving off a massive amount of energy, especially through our thoughts. You know, our thoughts are giving off some crazy, crazy energy. We're sleeping and when our sleeps, we're astral projecting. And, you know, because we're actually projecting this energy is, that's it's just flowing all around the city. So, of course, they're going to spray the sky to try to make it cool, you know, bring that cooling in. But for the most part, our planet is heating up. You know, your body is, has a sickness. We're going to burn off that virus. And that's what's going on right now. You see down in, 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 in um, Florida, the temperature has already hit 106. Um, there, uh, brother today said, you know, hey, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, the West Coast got a got a temperature of 130, 140. I said, I wouldn't be surprised neither. But right now, you know, Alaska said um, a high of 92 uh, as far as today is concerned and the rest of this week. Alaska is a high of 92. Um, you got uh, Siberia that's already hitting at uh, 85. Um, they're looking at the ice, how the ice is melting. Remember we talked about, I talk, I was telling you guys about the poles and how the poles are shifting. You know, you got a, we have an electric pole, we have a magnetic pole. They only want to talk to you about one of the poles. They say, oh yeah, the poles is shifting and it's, and it's already at Siberia. That's one of the poles, but the other pole is at Alaska. See, they don't want to, you know, that's the thing about it, you know, the science behind it all. You know, they don't want to tell you the truth, of course. You know, they're going to watch this right here because they know I'm deep into science. And it's, it's the science that, that, that matters. You know, science is nothing but mathematics. That's all science is. It's nothing but mathematics. So, basically, we're talking about a 400-year period, all right? And we told these orc beings that you have 400 years, all right? Now, 400, if you look at 400 doing in, in the form of numerology, Four is a sign of perfection, and you got two zeros, zero, zero. Zero is a symbol of the cosmos, and zero also is a symbol of the universe. So you got you got perfection, which we're bringing, up, bringing our planet back to perfection with the energy of the cosmos and the universe together. So, I mean, you know, we, we, we got to look at it as everything is mathematics. The science behind it. The science is mathematics. You know, you can't you can't have science without mathematics. True science has got numbers, you know, and if they have symbols, these symbols have some type of value. These symbols have some type of of uh, of um, uh, frequency value uh, as well as a vibrational value. So right now, um, out nature is really, really just doing her thing right now. She's doing her thing and. We're soon going to be joining in with nature, all right? <clears throat> because we can feel our evolution is happening, you know? Well, they can, and these orc beings are looking at, they're, they're, they're looking at us strange, you know? They're looking at us strange. They're looking at us in fear. And they have, you know, they, 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 do they have a right to fear us? Yeah, they got a right to fear us, you know? They got a right to fear us because, you know, they came here and they devastated so much of our planet. What they did was they created, they, they committed a sin. See, when you say a sin, we're not talking about somebody having sex. You know, you're having sex outside of marriage because the thing about it, when you, uh, technically, when you uh, are, are, are having sex with somebody, basically you're mating with them. You know, you're mating with this person. So, you know, technically you kind of like married to them, you know. But hey, you know, that's that's a um, totally different subject there. But what's happening is the fact that they committed a sin all right and we're talking about a we're talking about the, the a, a sin in the sense of uh of of, of 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 cosmic nature you invaded a planet that's a sin you caused the original people of a planet to fall that's a sin okay 
if we want to talk about sins and they want to go into a religion, and I'm not, I'm not going in religion. I'm going straight sin, which the sin is nothing but uh, criminal activity. If you commit a sin, you have committed criminal activity. All right. You, you invade a planet. You, you, you destroy the people of the planet. You, you strip them of their culture and their cultural values and, 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 and all of their uh, uh, ethical ways and their, their, their ancestral ways that that's a sin, right? You force the people to live according to how you want them to live. That's a sin. Then after you do all this and indoctrinate their minds, the, pe the minds of the people with, 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 with falsity, that's a sin, okay? Then you force the people <clears throat> to believe in laws that are not uh, uh, indigenous to the planet or the cosmos or the universe. All right, you you force these people to follow laws that are un, that are not indigenous. That's a sin. Now you got these people uh, uh, telling these people you can't stand against us. You can't carry a gun. You can't shoot us. You can't do this. You got to go according to biblical ways. That's a sin. So you see all the sins, or we can say the criminal activity that these work beings created on our planet, and 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 everything that they've done. So now what's happening is because we have awakened to this, all right, and we have awakened to this. What what's happening is that we are rising to a higher level of consciousness. All right, which is your consciousness is nothing but spiritual energy. All right, we're, high, we're raising ourselves to a higher level of consciousness, and now we're ready to transform into who we once were. All right, that energy is all around, so they feel this because they say, Wait a minute, you know what's going on? This is a 400 year period, it's all mathematics. You know, I'm a math, I'm, I'm the mathematician, I'm the mathematician. And only mathematician will be the ones who actually bring the true numbers of mathematics. I'm doing numbers and 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 all type of codes and 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 write down and and sometimes some of my publish and some of them I don't. I'm doing all type all type of mathematical values. So it's it's all math. It's math behind everything. So because we have awakened, that's mathematics. It's numerology. We're taking ourselves to a higher level of thinking, a higher level of, 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 of speaking, a higher level of living, all right? We're ready to be who we once were, all before. Now it's time for the transformation. That's why we talked about September. September is a beautiful day. They said September 21st, let's see, 921, 921, you know, nine plus uh, uh, two is uh, 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 11, plus one is 12 and then you add a number three to it because 2019 equals a number three and 12 plus three is uh uh, uh that 12 plus three is 15 one plus five is six six is the number for high energy all right six is the number for high energy so you know this this is this is something that that you know we got to look into mathematics everything has a mathematical value no matter what it is the ascension, the 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 descension, the 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 rising, the falling, everything is a mathematical value. It's all about the math. That's all it is. It's all about the math. And yes, I'm the mathematician. I am the mathematician, and I'm doing codes and and sequences and frequencies. And and uh, hold on here for a second. Yeah, I'm back. So yeah, I'm doing codes and 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 frequencies. And, and, and sequences and, and I'm pulling and uh, um, I'm going into higher dimensional areas and, and I'm going into, uh, I'm going underwater and into space and, 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 and talking to uh, uh, other cosmic elders and, 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 um, and, and, and in my private time, I'm raising the energy and raising the vibration of, 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 of my people. All right. That's all mathematics. It's all about the math behind the whole thing. It's mathematics. So what we're getting ready to be facing right now is the fact that our planet is heating up. 
That's all math. All right. All of our celestial bodies are returning mathematics. All right. All of our celestial bodies are returning. We're rising mathematics. And these organ beings are watching us. They're looking at us. This is why they're having all these private meetings and special sessions because they know that we're getting ready to rise at a higher at a at a at a, at a supreme level and they're going to they're going to have to fight. So we're going to be all up on the forefront. The at the first point it's going to be only 1% of our people. 1% of whatever the number is of our people on this land, it's going to be 1% of us who're going to be fighting and the rest are going to join in afterwards. Okay? And the first thing these org beings are going to have is they're going to have law. They're going to have their law enforcement to try to dupe us into uh, uh, to remaining indoctrinated in the law. And then they're going to have the coons come out. Your Jesse Jackson and your Al Sharpton. Oh, that must be law and order. That must be order. You can't do this. You can't stand up against the law. You can't fight them. Why can't we? Why can't we? All right. So you have to understand that they're going to they're going to be trying to use their illusions. And there is no mathematical value in an illusion because an illusion is not real. An illusion has no mathematical value whatsoever. It's just an illusion. It's just a mirage It's there and it's gone. Anything that has mathematical values. All right. Has a foundation of cosmic energy. All right. I'll say it again. Anything that has mathematical values has a foundation of cosmic energy, which means these laws that they created do not have a foundation of cosmic energy. The religion doesn't have a foundation of cosmic energy. All the, the movies and all the other stuff, that they don't have a foundation of cosmic energy, which means they're all illusions. These orc beings don't even have a, a foundation of cosmic energy, which means they're all illusions. And what do you do with an illusion? You destroy it. Why do you destroy it? Because it deters you from uh, from from reality. All right, my frequency is going like going way high right here on my on my on my uh, uh, left ear. So it's important that we understand that mathematics behind everything. Our planet is heating up. We're becoming more wise. We're becoming more uh, uh, alert. We're watching everything fall. We're watching their crop fall. They look at the potatoes. They're not even making growing potatoes in the ground anymore. They're growing potatoes. Uh, I mean, you it's, it's very seldom that you may see a, a bag of potatoes with, 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 with dirt on it. But for the most part, a lot of the potatoes you get, they don't have no dirt at all because these potatoes, are, they, they grew through what they call aeronautics. They're growing in, they're growing in the air. They're called air potatoes which means they don't have, some of these potatoes don't have uh, any type of uh, 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 energy from nature. They just growing them for mass production. That's why they rot so fast when you get them. All right, so it's important that we understand the mathematical values behind everything and they, how nature is rising and how we're rising we got all these earthquakes going on. The planet is getting hotter and hotter and hotter. And when you have a virus, what do you do? You burn that shit off. You have a fever and you burn it off. And who's the main focus? Who's the main focus that awakened the planet for the fever? We did. We all did that. So give yourself a pat on the back. Give yourself a pat on the back because it was because of you who had awakened it's because your awakening, you made that change. Everything is mathematics. This ascension is mathematics. There's a mathematical values that's going on. That's why it's important for us to tap into the demonic forces, the angelic forces. It's important for us to do our meditation, do our chants, to do your Tai Chi. Everything behind that has a mathematical value. You might can't see it, but you can feel it. Because behind math is energy, and behind energy is is a frequency and a vibration and that, and behind that frequency, and vibration and that energy and all is true power. 
And this is where we're going to because now we want to go into invincibility. Now we want to tap into the um and, and into the uh, uh elements. All right. And because now we are desiring that which is of true mathematical value, which is the elements, moving to the elements and all that. Now we're tapping into the foundation of the cosmos. We're not looking for a lot of us are not looking for money and shoes and clothes because that doesn't have any uh, 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 cosmic foundation. They're all illusions. We're looking for stuff that's going to actually give us life. That's going to extend our life. Immortality, invincibility. That's mathematical value because now that has a foundation in the cosmos, which means that you want to tap into the infinite cosmos and you want to be the infinite being just like the cosmos. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that at all. So we must understand everything has a mathematical value. And the math behind the destruction of these orc beings is happening right now. The math behind all of this is happening right now. Everything. The math is everything. We're going to watch the rivers begin to boil. Crops are going to become lost. I mean, right now, it's, it's, it's a massive amount of crops that's happening. This is dying off right now. That's why they're trying to grow everything in greenhouses and, and the energy of the planet. The math, the math, we're getting ready to write the math for the energy of the planet to rise and destroy the GMOs while they're growing on their roots. <clears throat> it's all the math behind it. You destroy the resources that your enemies use to make to keep them powerful, to make them feel powerful. You destroy the resources and they have no other choice but to die or to fight to try to get something that doesn't belong to them. <laughs> it's all the mathematical values behind everything. All right, my people. Gotta go. We'll talk a little later. <laughs> Hope you understood this right here. All power to the multi-chakra celestial energy beings. Peace to you all.